I hear that for first buyer have the opportunity mm. to to get a loan from government. Is that true? Which for one? the first buyer, first buyer, first time home buyer, mm -hmm. first time home buyer, it 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 need a, still need to have a good credit for mobile home. Really? Five percent, yeah. it's five percent down is uh, what we can do. But I want to show you the house right now. Give me one second. Okay. I'll show you the house. I got a lot of house I can show you. Okay. So, uh, let me share the screen. So I want to show you this. We started search from the three bedroom and two bath. So let's go to the main screen right now. Mm-hmm. What part of San Jose? San Jose uh, is everywhere. Uh, it can be northern part, north part, north San Jose, south San Jose. I would like to find something around south San Jose south because San Jose. my kids' school are here and I like the area. Uh, believe me, uh, something I wouldn't buy some, uh, a place where are ghetto people, you smoker people there who only live from government there, sitting down there outside. No, I don't want that place. Believe me, I want something quiet where the same people live there. <laughs> Yeah, they, they are all very quiet. There are two okay. important things I want to say that when you search for mobile home, besides the price, one thing is the space rent that you need mm -hmm. to pay every month because yeah. mobile home stays in the park. Park need to pay every month. And the second thing is called the senior park. That means 55 years older people allowed to live there. If a people okay. under 55, we're not allowed to live there. Okay. So that limited your choice because you can only choose the family park, not the right. senior park. So I right. find out for you right now, we have a total 61. 61. We're starting, if we're starting from the highest price, you can see on the computer. I don't, yeah, you, I can you see, can it. see it, right? Okay. This one is a 385. I think this is probably well over your budget. Mm -hmm. I, I would think we starting from the, the last page, which is the lowest lowest price, starting the lowest price, 144 mm -hmm. 90. You may be able to take price like this and still you can find some good deal. I think from this page, it's all good for you. It's all good for you, but the only thing is uh, you probably need to have, uh, have a little bit more down payment. Little bit more oh, down payment. Okay. If we talk about 5%, that means you have a very good credit. 5% of that is a little bit money. It's so like $12,000 or so. You know. But if you look for under $200,000, you might be able to find something. But then okay. it probably needs to fix the problem. But we start from the last one, okay? Start from the last one. Okay. So this one is a 3,300 Navas, Navas, you know? This mm -hmm. one is uh, right the uh, Hillsdale Avenue and mm -hmm. uh, Carson, that's the south, San Jose. Oh, that's a good area, yeah. Can you, can you see the uh, the map I bring up? Yeah. Can you see the yeah, map? Yeah, I can see. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I know it's not a vice. I drive by there with every day, yeah. Yeah, so right, you can yeah. see this one is uh, next to Highway 87. Mm-hmm. 87 and uh, this is Monterey Road, so you know this is south. Monterey yeah. go all the way to south. So this one is close to Blossom Valley, the uh, mm -hmm. Vista Park. Yeah. Um, so it's right here, okay, somewhere in between this uh, mountain spring, this area. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we close and I want to show you this one first is a three bedroom and the two bath is 940 square footage. And the year bill was 1967. That's like a 53 years old already for this uh, mm. mobile home, particular one. But that doesn't mean they don't take care. They take care very well. And this one put on the market shelf for already 55 days. That's how you know is how long. Okay. And this is a number for the aging. This is the price right here. It's 144, 900. This is a very good price. Because since February, that's before the coronavirus pandemics, it's mm -hmm. been 55 days till now. It hasn't sold yet. Mm -hmm. And I want to show to you this one is uh, Grace Park to Top Park, 
low space rent. Space rent is low is good because you don't need to pay a lot every every month. And uh, they have a great fruit tree on the backyard, so that's mm. good. The so that's a large patio, yard. Yeah, there's a backyard. Yeah, there's a backyard. Yeah. But there's not 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 a very big spacious. It's just yeah. uh, enough, enough for, for the kids to play, people. right? Yeah, yeah. You can put enough for a few people to walk around. And uh little space you can grow trees, you can grow vegetables, uh -huh. you can grow a lot of things. Okay, so the first thing we check, remember, is a space rent. Space rent for this one is 728. That's a very good price. Because How much? 728. Right oh, here. 728. No. Because uh, in San Jose, everything below 1,000 or 1,200 or 1,000 in San Jose's mobile home rent is very, very good price. Consider very good price. Okay. Because you if add up what you owe, everything together. If you don't go over what you're paying right now, you pay 2,500 right now. If you add yeah. 728 plus a loan, and the electricity, the all the utilities bill you pay together is less than twenty five hundred dollars or a little bit over. That that is a good price because you just uh, spend uh, about the same money every month, so you, you won't spend okay. too much. There is one thing I want to let you know also about the space rent. This is all in the park. In the park, the park manager they will see if you qualify. The way they see you qualify is use the space rent. In this case, it's seven hundred twenty-eight dollars times three. So in this case, seven hundred twenty-eight times three is like a twenty-two, twenty-three hundred dollars. Your income has to go over twenty, twenty-three hundred dollars plus your mortgage. Assuming your mortgage, you pay eleven hundred dollars, twelve hundred dollars a month. Then you are qualified. Then you'll be fine because that these two add together. It's still less than seventy forty seven hundred dollars you have every month. Is that right? Because yeah. you have twenty two and then eleven twelve. That's like a thirty four thirty six hundred dollars. You make a forty seven hundred dollars, so you can qualify yeah. to apply for this mm -hmm. this house for this park. That's how they. But one question. I had I I was reading something. I was asking advice also. Uh, I want to ask about parking. One it's important to know about the parking, how long they are gonna have the parking always, or there is a limited time they're gonna have a parking there, or how's the parking? It comes to it comes you buy this mobile, it comes with a carport. Carport is like an awning, and uh, mm -hmm. there's no garage, not entire cover. You uh -huh. can cover here, the cover for sun and rain, and you can park next to your mobile home. I'll show it's you the only picture. for one car. Uh, up to three cars. For this one, oh, okay. you can okay. see it's up to three cars. This one is the three cars right here, carport. Okay. You can see that right here, three cars. Oh, and, okay. So, yeah, yeah. And your space rent is a 728. That's a very good price. And But this one, you see, second thing is see if you are senior. This one is in a senior park. You, you say run as resident must be 55 years older. So that means uh, yeah. we are not qualified. No. Because no. that's why two no, yeah. things you see. Okay, one is space rent. Second thing is the senior park or not, 55 years old. This one, self to sen senior citizen, 55 years older. So we cannot buy. We need oh. to move on to the next one. So let's go to the next one. This one is a 204 in San Jose. It's also three bedroom and two bath. Footage is a little bit bigger, 1120 square footage. It's 1995 years built. So this one is newer house. Price is good. It's 150,000 is, is good. And let's check on this one. See if this one is what you can afford. This one is a sixteen ninety five for a space rent. Is a little bit much. A lot. A lot. It's a lot. A lot That's more. a lot. So we might not consider this one. But yeah, no. The thing about Cook, because he also they were time three of the space rent to find out if your income is over that three times of sixteen ninety five. But looks mm. like your income is a little bit lower than that. So this one may not work for you. So we'll find out next one. Okay. Okay. 
This one is shear wood lane. This one is in two, 237 in North San Jose, close to uh, First Street. First Street, close to Milpitas. That's too far away. I had to be close around uh, my, my kids that live. Okay. Uh, I cannot move too far away. Yeah, okay. for it's too much problem. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Now we will move on to the next one, okay? This one is oh, the that's center close. Yeah. yeah, this one is close to you, but oh. I know this one you can buy, but they have a lot of problem in the house. They need a lot of a fix. Oh, but center, yeah. I don't like center road. You don't like center road? No, no, I don't oh. like that area. Yeah. Okay, we'll move on to the next one, okay? Yeah, please, thanks. Yeah, sure, sure. We don't want to. This one is Summerland. It's not bad. The price is almost 200000 but not yet. And mm -hmm. this one, the worst thing, this one is uh, this one is a uh, 55 years old, the senior part. So we mm -hmm. cannot, we cannot get this one, even though it's a good, okay. it's a good place and uh, good house. It looks very nice, but just we're not there yet. So it looks it looks nice and well organized. They already move out. That means you can move in right away. And the kitchen is very spacious. They have a bathroom. There's a room right here. So this one, almost there, but not yet. But we'll go to the next one, okay? Okay. This one is Capital Expressway. 1520 oh. Capital Expressway. Let me, I need to check this one. It's in 101, that's in uh, close to downtown. Let me see, where is this? Yeah. If you, you think this capital. is fine for you. This one is as. Capital Expressway and the 101, close to Silver Creek. Oh, okay, yes, around here, yeah. Yeah, around your place, right? Yeah, around, kind of, yeah, around. Yeah, so I think this one should be fine, but most important thing right now, we find out if the price is good for you. 823, that's good. No age restrictions, no oh. restrictions, so you can live here. This is a family part. Family park, you can live here. A23 mm -hmm. is a very good, below 1000, that is very good price range. Let's take a look mm -hmm. at the house. Three bedroom, two bath, 1200 square feet, is even bigger, but it's 1969. Years built, is 51 years already. This one just on the market mm -hmm. for five days, so that means a lot of people will place, mm -hmm. try to buy this house. Uh, let's see what they have, okay? They have it here, okay. they have a bathroom, it's bathtub, they have a cable TV. I don't know if uh, you're going to pay for cable TV, I don't know, but they have a cable mm -hmm. TV connection at least. Mm -hmm. And central AC, so not bad, they have an AC, that means air conditioning. Right now you need yeah. air conditioning. And, uh, and heater, yeah. heater also? Uh, Oh, no. uh, heater, yeah, of course. Heater is yeah, always do, come right? with it. Yeah. Heater is okay. essential force air for heating. Oh, okay. right so yeah, this yeah. one is covered. So I think this is, should be your good choice. The only thing is the price a little higher. And this one is on the market for five days. So if we give too low price, they might wait for next customer to mm -hmm. place over. There's a tile floor in the dining room. This is a uh, hallway, yes, mm -hmm. and this is a uh, bath. Uh, the kitchen, the kitchen. It looks like uh, they because they live here, so that's why they live here. So that's the reason. Oh, they're still living, yeah. Yeah, but if you place offer, they will leave. You know, they if they accept your offer, mm -hmm. they will leave. This one right here. This one right yeah. here. This is bad. Not, not bad. This is a tile floor. Because mm -hmm. they take care very well, even though it's 1969, but it looks very new. They have a drapery, heart curtain. Mm -hmm. This bedroom is big, very spacious. They have this is a bathroom. This is a shower room. So it's not bad, not bad. Yeah. This looks like uh, you need to you need to turn your head. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. <laughs> this one is a walking closet, so it's very big for it. It's very spacious. This one is good. 
this laminate floor inside, you can tell. Oh, laminate, it looks nice. Oh yeah, easily clean, that's easy. Wash your dryer, this is a wash your dryer. This is uh, when you car your, park your car right outside and you can walk in from here. This is different mm. from the main entrance. They have two, oh, and okay. two doors. One is in the front for guests. Another one is on the side for you. When you come home, park your car, you can come in from this door. Oh, okay, that's at the back, okay. Uh, well, in, a set, in the center of the mobile home. So yeah, this one right here. This one is the backyard, side yard, backyard. You can see, you can see they have a patio right here. Mm -hmm. And uh, then you can have your kids playing around backyard yeah. and patio door. So patio, very nice. So right now is a sun, very hot summer day. The air conditioning is very good. This is very good. This you go in from either you go in from here or you go in from yeah. the other side. That one you once you go into this store, you'll be able to see the washer dryer. <clears throat> And you can power three cars right here. Hmm. This is called double, double wise. You can see that clearly they divide into half. If this is only one, it's called single wide. There's two for double wide. Majority three mm -hmm. and two, three bedroom and two bath is, is, uh, is double wide. It's combined, it's combined to into the house. So it's very nice. Yeah. These are pictures. So I will take this one for you. This one is the East Capital Expressway. And it's close yeah. to 101, and I believe it's close to you. And the price is very nice. I thought price is very nice. So let's go to the previous one again to see. This one is good. This one is El Bosque Drive, but this one is a testament. This is North. But that's North not, yeah. not, not your choice. Oakland mm. is North, probably not your no. choice. No, yeah, Oakland Road. I think that one is probably the best. This one is also in the North. So you don't, you don't sell, you don't sell uh, any mobile home at uh, Sun Park mobile home. Sun Park. Are you have Sun Park who are located just here by Blossom Hill, close where I live. That's a very, very nice. I have a friend who just recently, two, I think they bought a two years ago, they bought a mobile home. It's very nice. Every time you pass, they say, oh, I like that. But you don't have okay. a nothing. Give me one second. I'll yeah. send this one to you first. Okay. You should be able to receive this one, okay? And okay. let's go down to, you say the different park? Okay, I you say. Should, uh, you should receive it right now, but uh, we'll go to a different park. Okay. Okay, we'll, we'll change that to two bedroom, two bath. Mm. Then we can see different things, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah, and it's gonna be San Jose also. This price is relatively very close to your range, even though they still have a very expensive price, but you can mm -hmm. see the price drop significantly. You can buy something that is a much better price. We're starting from, from this one. Is that okay for you? 229, 500, and we go all the way down, okay? Okay. This one is a mountain spring. It looks nice. This also in the south, Mountain Spring right oh, here. Oh, South San Jose, yeah. Yeah, Communication Hill, you see? Communication oh, Hill nice. surrounding, they have a lot of mobile home parks. They have a lot of mobile home parks. That, so let's see this one right here, okay? Mm -hmm. This one right here, you have a Hillsdale. Remember, remember, we watched the previous one, is also Hillsdale. Yeah. This one is... The Highway 87, Capital Expressway is right here. 
and uh, Hills Day is right here. This mm -hmm. one is the south. Yeah, I know. A little close by, yeah. Yeah. So let's yeah. see two nice. things we need to check. One is a uh, space rain, another one is uh, 55 years old. This one is 55 years old. So we don't look at this one right now. Let's go to the next oh, one. Oh, yeah. It's for senior. Yeah. That's yeah. correct. Meal Pao Dry. Let's check on to see this is 55 years old. So that's not for us. Next one is uh, Oakland Dry. You don't want to go there. So let's move on. Oakland? Oakland. Is, Oakland uh, Dry. What is the zip code? I don't know what the zip code is. Looks nice. But the zip code 95123, let me see the map. Um, okay, this one, okay. Let's see this one first, okay? Oakland. Oakland is close to North, North San Jose, close to, close to Milpitas. Oh yeah, no, no, I don't want to go that side. It's too far away from my kids' school and that's, yeah. yeah. So if we don't do that, we go to the next one, yeah. okay? Okay. This one is a Hermitage. Same thing, this one is uh, close to Milpitas. 237. Okay. Mm, no, too, 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 yeah, too, too, too far, far away. away. Yeah, too far yeah. away for you, yeah. Let's go to the next. This one, Blossom Hill, that's close to you. Oh, this one looks nice. Oh, yeah, nine, five, one, two, three, two. Yeah, I like that. I like that. The color you like, right? Oh, Blossom Hill. I like Blossom Hill. Let me check. This one is a senior park, Let's or see. this one is, um, wow, this one is a senior park. Oh. But the price is good $830. That's why I was just for next one. Evans. Evans Wait, is south know. also. That's uh, close to Santa Teresa. Yes. Yeah. Oh Al yeah. It's... Al Al Maiden. Almaden. Almaden. This is a small park. Evans is a small park. I've been there many times. But uh, we yeah. see this one is uh, no age restriction, so you can do that family park. Nine twenty two. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good for you. Let's check on the house. Let's check on the house. This one should be nice. You like this one? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it looks nice and tight. Yeah, it is very oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the kitchen is look, looking very good. I like the Very big, floor. it's also very big. The yeah, kitchen is lighted. Yeah. yeah. They have this for the, this is a, this is for a senior. Uh, you, you need to turn your head. And you hit oh. like this side. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, the bathroom. Oh, that's a bathroom. Yes, yeah, so a shower and the bathtub. Yeah. Uh, they don't change this picture, so you need to take a look, look at it, like, you know, change your head. Yeah. This one, beautiful bath. This one is a <laughs> master bedroom, you, you, the one you use. You see, this come with a bathroom right here. You can yeah, use this one. You can have a, you. How old are your kids? Two, two kids. Uh, seven and five. Seven oh, and five. Seven and six. So, yeah. You can They'll have live. them to both stay in one room or one here with you, one year with that. You know. Yeah, one year, but they're gonna grow. Eventually, they will want own room. That's why I think three bedroom because they mm -hmm. will grow. They yeah. will grow eventually. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. For now, they stay in one room together. Yeah. Yeah. So. I'll keep this one for you, okay? Mm -hmm. Because I think this one is not bad. Let's go to the next one. This one okay. is uh, uh, Navar, the same place. Narvaez? Na uh, Nar Narvaez, yeah. Yeah, Narvaez. Two bedroom, two bath. This one is in communication, okay, the same place. Here's, here's the all, no, all in the same place. So we can take this one. First thing to check is see if this is a senior park. 55 years old, this senior park. We cannot take this one. Mm -hmm. So let's move on to the next one. This one, same thing, is a senior park, 3300. So we'll move on to the next one. Mm -hmm. Oakland Road, too far away. Too far away, yeah. Yeah, so we don't do this one. 
Oakland Road, too far away, we don't do this one. This one is uh, lost in, in, in Sino. So they're so far away because the zip code. Yeah, so we have a choice of few. I think we took a two, is that right? For two bedroom? Yeah, two bedroom, but I would like three, honestly, yeah. Yeah, but I will send this one to you as a, maybe a backup so you have a okay. rough okay. idea. This one. Let me search your email address again. Okay, so we have uh, <clears throat> one more one. This one is a two bedroom, two bath, okay? Okay. So I sent to you, you should have uh, information. Okay. So you should have a two. I wanna pull up the, the first one I sent it to you. This one, the three bedroom, two. Three bed, three bedroom, two bed. The price is two nineteen nine hundred. This one is not bad. That's I'm not bad. The, uh, the space range is uh, eight hundred twenty three dollars. It's very good price. Not bad. How will, how will, how much will be approximately the rent? The monthly, uh, the mortgage. I mean the payment. The monthly payment or mortgage. Uh, how much approximately would be the expensive and cheap uh, in, and lower? I mean, yeah, you're talking about a monthly payment for the space rent, is that right? For the space rent and uh, the no, but if I buy it, I have to pay. Oh, to mortgage, lower, you're talking right? about a mortgage, yeah, okay. So let's see the price. This one, okay, this one, 219,900. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's go here, let's go to. I use this company to help me to calculate. Okay. Let me show you. Yes. Can you see my screen right now? Yeah, I can see. Okay. So this company, 21st Mortgage Corporation, this is a big company. They yeah. do majority business of a mortgage in the loan for okay. our California. And they are award winning. They have a 10 years award in the in the in the in the in the row. There are 10 years a row in a row. So you very good company, very good service. All okay. my customers use their service. Okay. So that this is a calculator. Okay. So when you start, choose your state. They do almost 50 states, everybody. So we're here in the California, we'll pick a California. And there is Right here, this one is, uh, who are you buying from? You're buying from me as an individual. I'm the realtor. So you click on this one. Mm -hmm. And what are you buying? You're buying from, I am buying a home within community or park. You're buying from this one, okay? It's mm -hmm. inside the park, that's why you pay space rent. Okay, how many applicants? You only buy yourself, so you only mm -hmm. have a, solo applicant, so only by yourself. And this one, the price, this one is 10 years old or older, this one is 10 years older because it's 1969, something like that. So we choose that. And your credit, you say is between 600 to 30, 630. 30, right? yeah. So let's pick this one. The price is 219. Okay, that's this one right here. Okay, let me see. They calculate. They so calculate we find out that the price for the mortgage. You need a 10% down. Mm -hmm. That is a 21,900. That's 
that's a little bit more. And that's a 1907, that's monthly payment. So you have oh. that plus $800. This is 823, right? So 823, that's a 2700. A little bit more than what you pay right now. But you get your own space. You have your own, you have your own space and you live in a park. Okay. And uh, they have uh, all kinds of amenities. Amenities, they have a swimming pool, jacuzzi, they have a clubhouse, they have a barbecue area, library. They have a lot of things going on every now and then. They have a party in the house. This is the this is the two three bedroom, right? Yes. So let's try two bedroom, right? Two bedroom. We say is how much? Uh, I already sent to you, so I will check again. Not this one. This one, this one. Two bear and two bear. The price is uh, one fifty four nine hundred. This one probably you can do a lot better. One fifty four nine hundred. So this one is about still ten percent down, but it's a lot less. 15,490 and you pay 13 and we were talking about this one mm -hmm. this one the space rent is how much 922 mm -hmm. 922 plus oh that's less than what you pay right now oh yeah that's like a 2200 dollars that's like 22 2300 dollars so it's the cheaper to get this one. You can afford, you don't have to worry about, you know, you don't have to worry about, you don't have to worry about the money because you can pay and you can still save a lot of money. The only yeah. thing right now is 10% uh, down. The down payment, yeah. Yeah. It's so a down payment. Do you, do you, did you already save that much money that you can try? Yeah. Uh, no, right now I I can only put ten thousand, but in couple months later I will have maybe I will reach to fifteen thousand or more. Yeah. Or we can go uh, with with it. That that's really we what our choice is. So so that's that's what it is. Or you can yeah. have your husband, your ex husband, to help you for five thousand dollars. Yeah, I, I, I would, it would, yeah, I would, it would, it would. You would help but you? I'll, but this is only two bedrooms, I think. Yeah, but then the kids is small, and you can probably stay this way for a few years. Oh, no, but then, the, you know, the, the cost will go lower, it's not the same. No, I wouldn't, I wouldn't like to be moving, moving from places. I would like to buy something that stay more years. Yeah, it's hard for me. I'm a single mom. It's hard for me to be moving different places, you know. And now that I, I'm a first-time buyer, I wouldn't like to buy something like that to plan to move another place. I wouldn't like it. Yeah. Uh, so, what about can your husband, ex-husband, help you for that much? Uh, twenty-one nine, twenty-one nine nine hundred. That's like a Twelve thousand dollars. Can he help you for twelve thousand dollars? I have to talk to him. Uh, I don't think that much money would be. It could be, but I uh, could be. Uh, could be. I need to talk to him. Yeah. I think uh, we we can try to ask for lower price, but if we get too low, the seller might not accept the price. Mm, okay. Yeah. So. The best way to do is is a uh, higher down payment, so you can yeah. resolve a lot of issues. So see if your ex husband can help you for that mm -hmm. much. I will. I will reach to twenty twenty thousand um, dollar. Maybe in uh, two three months, I will reach to twenty thousand dollar for sure because I'm saving. Uh, 
Um, but right now I, will, I only have him to ask him if he can do that. Yeah, yeah, see if uh, he can help you. If he's help for like 15,000, he will help you tremendously. You will be in much better shape. You might not pay up to eight, 1900. You might pay just $1,800, $1,800 a month. That that be that will save you a lot, and also the rent, space rent is eight hundred twenty-three dollars. So that's like twenty-six. Yeah, you don't probably. own anything right now, but you own your place. Yeah, yeah, it's my my place. Yeah. That's the most important thing. You want to have your yeah. dream home. That's yeah. the most important thing. Uh, I have a question. Yes. I have a question. Um, uh, is that allowed to have a, a to rent one room? To someone, I was thinking that yes, maybe I can do that. Yes, a lot of yeah, people I can do get that. help to get money to yes, pay my yes, land or something. Yes, yes, you can do yeah. that. You can do that. Yes, a lot of people. Yeah, it's it's allowed, right? It's not that I oh, know you cannot bring other person because yes, I know yes. it, park has a lot of restrictions. But I was, restrictions I was thinking you, you to do to that report. way. Yeah. Report. Okay, what you do is uh, when you apply. When you apply with loan, you apply yourself. But when yeah. you apply with a park, you can bring in your tenant, whoever want to live with you, take that room, apply together to help you. Oh, I have to report, approval, yeah. Even though you pay by yourself. But yeah. you ask that person to help you so that you have a, looks like you have a, both of you have a higher income. So that park approve both of you to live in there. Oh, okay. He doesn't yeah. pay anything. He only pay you the rent. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He only pay you the rent, but he doesn't pay you anything else. Yeah, anything else. You're the one right. pay everything, yeah. but he, he pay you the rent so he can pay rest of the, the charges from the park. Because that would that would help me a lot. That's so what I would Oh, be, tremendously. Uh, You've been charging seven hundred dollars. Yeah. yeah. Eight hundred dollars for you yeah, know, to pay there. the land, to pay for yeah, the land. Pay the, uh, so the land rent. will be paid about a tenant. Right? Yes, yes. And then you pay the rest. So you say I only pay the rest. Yeah. Yes, yes. And I will have two bedroom. Uh, that's what I, I plan, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, I w I have to talk to my kids dad because uh, I really I'm really interested in buying uh this year a house if they pay too much money on rent. Yes, I think so. A lot yeah. of people don't want to make uh, the landlord better because landlord basically just give you the space you pay them, so you know they can be living under your rent. They can be living your from your income. You pay yeah. them their income. Yeah, we basically work to pay rent. It's a, the rents are very expensive right now. Uh, yes, especially in the is. area, yeah, in the yes. area is very expensive, and I think it would be a little cheaper. But depends. I don't want to live in the uh, no good areas because my kids. So I don't want them to grow in the areas that are not good for them. Yeah, I say just try to see if your husband can agree with you to help you, and you see your see your friend can yeah. help you to apply together. Even though he doesn't pay you anything, he doesn't pay park anything, he pay you the rent so that you can... Yeah, 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 that would be very good. Yeah, yeah he pay you the rent and you, can, you don't have to worry about a lot of money. Yeah, yeah, it's, a, it's, it's much less than paying here. Yes, by and, myself, uh, you, yeah. much bigger space, I believe. Yeah, much bigger space and uh, my kids have her own, their own room, I will have my own room. Yes. Like, yeah, I have an extra room. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But he is gonna live with you. He help you to pay the rent. That person, whoever that person is gonna help you to pay rent. Then you have a third room. So two kids stay in one room. You stay in the master bedroom. Yeah, exactly. And uh, whoever helping you out for another room. So that uh, when you much better, you much better shape, then you can. As the person he can leave and you can your kids can have one for each room you know hey i have another question yes. i have another question yeah uh, uh, because i'm thinking about to make more money i think to to i work as a nanny i don't make my money compared with the store they pay less uh, customer service store they pay a lot of less but as mm -hmm. a nanny i i make at least to survive it 
in Pay My Rain Well. And I was thinking in the future, do you think it's allowed to have a, to run a home care in a home, a mobile home? No, they, that, this is for residents. They don't allow you to do this. Oh, business. they don't. They don't allow you to. You can yeah. do like anything in the park to go to somebody to take care and make some money for this kind of thing, but you cannot do for business. Oh, you know, you you can, use it's your, not allowed. It's use, not allowed. Yeah, you cannot use your space to do for business. They don't allow you to do that because they consider this as a <clears throat> the residential, mm -hmm. not for the com not for the commercial, not for the business. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. No, but I hear that uh, this. Also, when we sign a, a contract here in the complex, also they say it's not for business. But Santa Clara County say they, they cannot deny when a, a family live there and they it's not a, a big business. It's like family home care. It's not a daycare. Daycare is another thing. Uh, family home care is when a family that's... take care of four kids like yeah. that, right? Yeah. That you can ask the park manager to find out. They maybe they have that for some part maybe allowed. Yeah. Uh, we need to find out from the park management to find out if they allow us to do that. Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, you can. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I believe you can. You can ask to find out. Yeah, uh, because they can, do talking it, about daycare is big, but home family daycare is small, only like a three, four kids. That's all. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. If you can do it without they notice or something, you probably can do it. They don't mm. find out. I'll be fine probably need to get a license or something. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Just, yeah. I have no idea, but you can ask. Probably somebody is doing it in the, in the park, you know. No, even the apartment contracts say no, but uh -huh. I, I ask it, Santa Clara County say, even they say no, they have to let you do it because a uh, uh, family home daycare cannot be denied because it's not a big business. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, but I have never tried because I'm still working now, right now, yeah, so yeah, I have a Sunny later to ask once you move in to ask the park manager to find out see if they yeah. allow you to do I, I think you can probably find out from there. Yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah. But as far as this goes, I think this is a very nice home. Uh, you can tell the picture that at least they take care of the house very well. Yeah, who's living there? Or oh, they all they were living somebody you know, this the is owner? A family park. They have a kids stuff in there. You see oh, this okay. red right here. Yeah. They have a kids yeah. stuff in there. So you know they have the, this one is a family. Yeah. The reason people move because they can make money. You know the mobile home you live ten years in this Bay, Bay Area in San Jose, they grow almost double. Really? I thought yeah. it was it was lower because it's not a regular home. No, the, because this is in San Jose, the value go up. Now, I wouldn't say 10 years, probably, if not double, it will be close to 70, 80% of the increase comparison to when you buy. And besides, people live here, obviously, people, some people live here for the rest of their life, but some people live here for 10, 15 years, and then they move up because the rent increased 3% every month, every, every year, 3% every oh. year. So the the what do you mean you mean the the land they increase the the land uh, the, the space oh, rent they increase it how much percent three percent every year how much three percent three percent so always always this year they didn't increase because coronavirus oh yeah. Yeah. But beginning of next year, they will increase. Oh, but you only pay eight hundred something twenty three dollars, thirty three dollars. It's it's nothing. It's very very. It's very cheap. I mm. say very cheap. If so you over one thousand, yeah. then you need to think about moving because maybe it's too much or something. But if it's below one thousand in San Jose, it's a very good price because you think about two bedroom. What are you renting right now? You're renting two bedrooms right now, right? Yeah. Two bedrooms right now, you pay $2,500? Yes. And then they only pay $800 plus the mortgage. That's like a $2,200, $2,300. That's still cheaper than two bedrooms. 
And this one, you own your house. Your house is much bigger. You have a front yard, you have a backyard, you have a amenity, you have a swimming pool, you have a car wash, you have a car garage, you have a, you know, you park carport, and you have a library, you have a clubhouse. You have a lot of things, barbecue, they have a lot of things going on in the park. And let's talk about in five years, I'm going to mm -hmm. pay a lot about uh, uh, lands. Yeah, they, they increase three percent every so one hundred dollars become one oh three and next year become one oh three plus another three percent based on one oh three. That's another three and a half dollars, that's a one oh six point five. You know, and then next year one oh six point five, another three percent, that's mm -hmm. another four dollars or so. So it's not oh no, it's even less than that. So a, you, you, you can afford it for a few years, for many, many years to come. Until you go up to $1,000, that's many, many years. That's like 10, 10, 15 years. So you don't have to worry about the rent, really. Yeah, I see. Yeah, you don't have to worry about the rent. It's not, as long as you're working and you're fine and you have an income, you don't have to worry about that. But uh, the thing is, uh, in a family park, people live there for only for the purpose of kids growing. If a kids grow to some, you know, older, they move out and you probably don't need a big space like this anymore. You right. can still later to make money because everything you pay during these 10 years, 12 years, 15 years is coming back to you by the time you sell the house. You know why? Because in the Bay Area, all the mobile home grow just like house grow. Mm. 70, 80 percent by then when you sell. Wow. So you can you make some money. Right now oh. you buy twenty one hundred thousand dollars, you have a you have a loan. When you sell maybe close to four hundred thousand dollars, maybe like uh, 35, 335, 350,000 or something like that, very close to the range. By the time you sell you make some you make over like 12, between 120 to 150,000, and you, everything you pay comes back to you. Right. You use that money to buy a house later on. That's, a, that's a, a lot of people's plan. A lot of people are planning to live here, save money, and once they sell a house, the difference between the payoff loan, loan you originally this much, right? And right. then Pay, 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 pay all, pay off, like this much. But 10 years later, the house value is this much, a lot more. And the long as this much, you sell the house, take out a loan, take out uh, some cost, you still have this much. That's yours. Mm. That's, that's how you make money. That's how people do it in San Jose for a mobile home and also condo, townhouse. That's how, and then you say that you buy Three bedroom, you can rent it out for people for one two years to make help you to pay some rent, help you to pay some bills, and that save you some money right there. Yeah, I'll save some money that's for sure. A lot sure. of people do, not just you. A lot of people do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a lot of people do. To find the right oh. people, then they can help you. Yeah. Okay, uh, your name is, what, you, what is your name? Marty, M-A-R-T-Y. Marty, right, Marty. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for your time. I will talk to my kid's dad tonight. I will send you a message of what he say. And once you, if you decide, there is an application, this one application I want to show you to. Okay. You just go with, a, here say apply with her today. You just click on this and then your email go in there, set up your password and you, you submit that. You will need pay stops. Your okay. pay stop from your company and you will need uh, the W2 for past two years that you say you already have. You probably need uh, the income tax for past two years you already have. And they will ask you to submit your social security card and driver license. Just take a picture and send it to them. And they will give you a paper for you to send it to your company, verify your employment history, 
employment pay and all that. And then they will ask you to go to the park to apply for residence. That's when your tenant should apply with you together because you have double income, be easier to approve by the park and you apply the loan by yourself. And uh, once you go into the contract, there will be a lot of paper need to sign. We will sign, if they accept our offer, they will go into the agreement contract. Then they will, they will verify your employment, verify the, the loan is gonna be approved. Once they approve the loan, they will ask you to spend $325 for the appraisal. The appraisal basically is to check out the house, see if the house you buy is actually worth that much. So the house you buy is worth $219,000. Not, you can go over or go low, but not a lot. They must make sure the price range is what you pay for. So they can approve you, and once they approve you, then you're pretty much done, and they will give you the inspection report, they will give you the seller's disclosure, tell you everything they wanna know about the house. So you need to read that and also you need to understand the house, what's going on with the house. And we need to see if something needs to be repaired with the house, you know, do all that arrangement. And once the loan is found, once the loan approved, it takes a few days for loan to be found. And we can sign the paper. Once you sign the paper to the loan fund, as soon as they fund, that's like uh, maybe within a week or so after you sign the paper. Or maybe on the same day, we don't know, because everything is hard to say. But uh, with that range, once the loan is found, then you can get a key and move into the house. And this will be yours. It will be yours. That process takes about four to six weeks. Oh, okay. So that's that's the purchase price, purchase home process. Everybody yeah. buy the home, doesn't matter house they buy condo town home mobile home everybody go through the same thing oh about four to six weeks yeah so, time yeah yeah this is uh not just a process we would go through okay so I I got it. Mm -hmm. see if you have a you know i i want you to give a deep thought what you what kind of questions you have i want to answer all the questions you have right now so that you can go talk to your husband, that you you know what what to tell him, and then he asks you have an answer. Yeah, I will talk to him tonight about what he say. And then say if he, you know it's not you want to you, you want to show him two houses, the one with the higher price, the one with the two bedroom two bath. He show him two houses, see what he say. Because uh, yeah, my suggestion is uh, yes, you're right. If you want to buy a bigger house with more room, but you also think about your income and you pay for it. You don't want to be a lot of burden when you when you work. You understand? You understand? Right. You feel a lot of burden when you live there. That's that's very hard, and you you, you will not feel comfortable. If you want to be comfortable, then you need to yeah. You make sure you, you are comfortable. That's the most important. Thing. With the price, absolutely. Uh, yeah. When you pay. With a mortgage you pay all together, you should be paying less than what you pay right now. Yeah, you for real estate. Yeah. But, but you, you should be comfortable with what you're paying. You understand? Know you should yeah, be I You don't feel comfortable, that means uh, it's gonna be very hard. And But also, you can find your roommate, your tenant to help you to pay for your rent. Yeah, that's what I that's what I think. Yeah. yeah. If you want to think about that, that would be one thing you can consider. Find somebody you you know very well, good friend, and is working and pay. Then you know you can have him to this person help you pay pay for your space rent every month. So you you save a lot of money. Yeah. You save a lot of money. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of saving. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of savings. And uh, do you do it besides besides uh, you don't have a car payment, right? No, I don't have a car payment. No. You have a credit card. You say your credit card payment. I have credit cards. I my debt right now would be less than thousand. Yeah, my my suggestion is if 
if you can pay off, pay off before you apply for a loan. Because that oh. will help you a lot. You know, you save a lot of, a few, one or two hundred dollars a month. That's a lot of money. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah. Oh, God. So it helps when I pay everything off because I was reading because I recently paid uh, like three cars full, the biggest uh -huh. one. I recently, uh -huh. like a month and a half ago, I did it. So my credit then increased. So I have Home Depot, Target, maybe both of them. That's, that's all. Yes. And that's all. And I uh, was thinking to pay. Uh, it's, not, it's not too much. Yeah, yes. My, I encourage you to pay off because it, it okay. really helps you. It really helps you, really. It's better not to have any doubt. No, owe, no, don't owe anything before you buy the house. Oh, After okay. you buy the house, you can buy another car, you can buy furniture, you know, you can buy whatever you own, you know. But before yeah. that, you want to get into a house, you want to be clean. Oh, when I check okay. on your record, you want to be clean. You want to okay. don't want a lot of things. So pay off is better. But after you move in the house, you can buy furniture, you can buy a new car, you can do, you know. Oh, anything. yeah. Oh, yeah. As long as you can afford, you know, it doesn't matter. But before you yeah. do, before you apply for, I mean, before you move in the house, apply for loan, that's, don't company check. They check on your everything about your money, about your. Oh, okay. Income. That's good to know. That's good to know because, yeah, yeah, I'm very interested in buying that, ah, buying a mobile home and. Yeah, I'm gonna pay my cars. It's not that much I can pay today, so it's not too much. I, I don't like to own too much money. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's, that's true, right. that's true. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. It's good to move the you move for your credit, you know, but not too much. I, I'm not like that. <laughs> I'm very stingy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I understand. I understand. Yeah. Nobody wanna pay a shot, right? Yeah. Because you, yeah. you if you, you don't pay, there will be always interest. Always, yeah. That's like the twenty 26%, 25%, something like yeah, that. Yeah, it's a lot. Yeah, you it's a don't lot. Pay, you just keep going, keep going, you know, keep and rolling. And then you rolling, never rolling. get to pay. Is that you only pay interest. <laughs> yeah, you compound, you know, just compound, yeah. keep compounding. You, you cannot pay it off. So yeah, you it's true. Just pay one time to get rid of that, then you don't have to worry about it anymore. Yeah, it's true. You don't it's true. Worry about it anymore. Because this thing you pay off, first of all, your credit score go up. Second, you don't need to worry about the monthly payment for that anymore. Yeah, it's not an extra monthly payment that I had to deal with yeah, besides the mortgage. Credit is very important because they check on your credit when you apply. They check okay. on your credit and then you pay off, the, 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 the credit will increase very fast. Increase the score, then you pay, the chance you pay less of down payment is better and it saves you more money. For the interest to go down so you, you okay. don't pay a lot of money you can save some money every month that for something else you know rather than pay to them i see yeah my, my suggestion okay. is uh, to pay the cards yeah yeah pay, i will uh, i will do that i will do that yes. definitely yeah i don't wanna be making payments oh yeah i don't know i i, I never thought uh maybe in the future buy a car from the dealer but i never ah oh, no i don't want to make payments mostly <laughs> yeah. yeah before you buy the house don't don't the owe house anything. better than car now <laughs> yeah it's the best not to owe anything uh, yeah. after you buy the house then then they'll be okay as long as you can afford you can pay off that'll be fine yeah that'll be fine. okay okay i'll talk to my kids back tonight yeah i'll see I will see and I will send you a message. Yeah, let me know because this house is just on the market right now. I don't think it will last for long because it's yeah, new and fresh. I, I can, and I uh, if you like it, we can go see the house also. But I okay. want you to to feel comfortable buying the house. That's a very important thing. Yeah. I don't say you want to live in there. I, I want you to live in there also. I want you to live in there also because you know, you, you don't want to live in an apartment for the rest no, of No, it's too much, man. Never going to be my, yeah. And it's not yours. You pay, this thing don't grow. It's not yours, you know. Even grow is not, you, you don't make money. But right. you live in a mobile home, it's yours. You pay, it grows. It gets you money back. You you get your money back by the time you sell the house. Sell the house. Yeah, my it. only concern is now that talking mm -hmm. to you is about the fee for the land, the percent that increase every year. I oh, I'm thinking about like a, ten years. 
10 years uh -huh. later, I had to move out again and because the got increased too much. Yeah, so, that's, a, that's everybody's plan. Everybody yeah. lives there in a mobile home is either considering to move out in 10 to 15 years. Oh, okay. So then they, they make, they sell the house. They, they have money on hand. They can buy the yeah. house. They can buy a house. They they uh, they will have the per the the they could have the the payment. down payment for a house, a regular yes, house. Yes, right? down payment. You have one hundred thousand dollars for down payment. Everybody think is a good idea. All the sellers see you have a lot of down payment. They take it. They take your money. But if right. you don't have a lot of down payment, they think about you know somebody else has more money that will take that person. You understand? And it's about in the future when you sell a house, your money is more than than others. Because this house, you own the house, it's yours. And you just maintain yeah. it good and 10 years later, the house value go up and you pay the loan go down. When you sell the house, you take the difference, you make this much. Mm. It's all yours. It's yours. Nobody take away. Nobody take away. Right. It's just uh, even though you pay, but actually you pay yourself. You pay when you sell everything you pay is coming back to you. Everything you pay, mm -hmm. the tax, utilities, right. space rent, mortgage, and uh, maybe some other costs you have, everything will come back to you when you sell a house in ten to fifteen years. Right. Because. Yes, we do have a lot of people live in a mobile home. Some people live in a mobile until they die, like senior park. They live oh, in a the mobile until they yeah. die. You know? But in a family park, people move, people move out. They may, maybe people live 20 years, but by the end of 20 years, they, still, they will still move out. People oh. will move, you understand? Because the land grows too much. Yeah. Yeah, the land, the the rain is a lot. You know, people don't want to stay that long, or they find other place better. They want to move out. You know, because yes, you live in the park, but they have a lot of uh, restrictions. Sometimes you feel like, that you know, they, you are restricted to do a lot of things. So oh, okay. there's uh, there's yeah. something that either you decide you want to move to other state, or either you decide to buy a house or you, you decide to buy another mobile home. People live between 10, 15, 20 years, they will, they, they will, move, they will move. They will take out and go somewhere else because they can make oh. money. The thing is yeah. they own the place, they sell it, they make money. Yeah, I can say, yeah, because it's all many years saving money than paying rent, it's, it's a lot of saving, yeah. Yes. Yes, it's just watch the house while you grow. And yeah. you, you live in the park, you see a lot, you will see a lot of people come and go. Just like you live in an apartment, you see a lot of people come and go the same. Right, yeah. Just because you, in destination, you want to own your house. Oh, you yeah, definitely, yeah. There's a lot, of, a lot of money in rain forever. Uh, no, I say no, it's too much, yeah. Yes. That, that's, a, that's a final step, but before people can do that, a lot of people choose to make money through buying the home they can afford. And mobile home is a good choice. Or condo or town home. But those things, condo, condo is more expensive in, in San Jose also. The starting price right now is, yeah, it's 500,000, 600,000, you buy three bedrooms, there's two stories, and you have a, you need to pay HOA, and you have a little backyard, just like uh, you own a mobile home. But oh, H what is HOA is for maintaining? HOA is for home owner association. Oh, okay. owner association. Everybody live in a condo, phone a association. Members are all from the owner of the house. Uh, oh, of the okay. They need to get together every month to have a meeting. Talk oh, about to, how they talk about issues like that. The condo, how they should do everything, you know. So, and then they need to pay fees. 
the left fee is used for renovation of the condo, paint the wall outside, or do the replace the new new roof. Oh, I see, I see. The landscaping management, cut the grass, you know, trim the tree, and all that. They pay all these things for for all the different things. I don't know. I, right now, I do not qualify for a townhouse, right? Yeah, you because that requires more down payment. That's at least uh, thirty thousand dollars, fifty thousand dollars, or twenty five, depending on where you buy, depending okay. on the price of the townhome, condos, and you know that's that's some of the condos is uh, within the four walls. Just like you live in an apartment, you only own the space you buy. Okay, you buy, but if you buy, you, you look like you live in an apartment. It's the same. You only own the space inside the house, inside right. the four walls of the uh, of the condo. Right. Outside is not yours. You can oh, use okay. it, but it's not yours. It's belong yeah. to everyone. It's the public. Belong to the park. Belong to the condo association. Not yours. Inside okay. is yours, outside is not yours. So right. I would say Mobong is a deal better, deal better because first of all, it's cheaper. Secondly, is uh, everything you add up still cheaper than you pay with a condo. Condo, you does $500,000, you pay $50,000, you still owe $450,000. That's every month you need to pay mortgage, every month. Oh, wow. That's a lot. That's a lot. People live only. People pay only when they live there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They, they, they pay. They don't live there. They sell. They you know they don't owe anything. They sell the house. They pay off every all the mortgage and they get the rest of money. See, it, you should think about the same thing. You sell, you buy, you pay. Once you leave, you sell everything. You still get the rest of money. You still get the rest of money. That's yours. And that's a lot. Everything you pay is coming back to you during these years. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Is a is a, is a long term because once you live over one year, everything considered long terms. So one year, two year, three year, five year, all the way to 10, 15, 20 years. Doesn't matter. It's long term. So you live there is still very long time. Very, very long time. Not like apartment, you, you know, every month you sign up, you need to sign, every year you sign one contract, second year you sign another contract, and then they increase the price, or oh, you think of too expensive, I want to move. You move to another apartment. The same thing, you sign another year, another year, and then a few years later, you still move out. This one, pretty much the same, but the thing is you own the price, you own, you own the mobile home. You own the right. So that's right. the most different things there. Okay. I wanted to give you the idea okay. that uh, it's yours. You take the ownership. What yeah, I just thought it's different. Yeah, absolutely it's different. Yeah, to have something. Uh... Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. Okay, Mr. Um, sir, uh, I'm, right. going, I'm going out to do my groceries. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, but thank you so much. Thank you for so much. I will send you a message as soon as I talk to my kids that tonight because I really want to ask him to see if I will have extra help. <laughs> you, you, do you have a family around town? No, it's myself. Them? It's just myself. Yeah, my whole family is my country. Okay, I, but the, nobody around around here or somewhere no no just me my kids yeah then uh, the best way is uh, ask for your ex-husband's help yes he's the only one <laughs> yeah. yeah he's the only one if he he want to help you you'll be tremendous yeah he, he yeah i will see i will see because i was talking to him i want to buy something i want to buy paying a lot of rent and yeah but you see he he said enough he has enough saving, you think, that can help you? Uh, it could be. He has some money. He could have some money. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. think uh, if he has some money, then, then you need to ask him if he can return it back to you. 
he can yeah. help you. Uh, no, no, you borrow from him. Obviously, he he probably you probably need to pay back to him. Oh yeah, he probably ask me to return. Of course, yeah. Yeah, you probably need to pay pay back to him in the future. So yeah, I I would think that that is a better way to do so because he can help you and if he can live with you. Wow, no, no. You need somebody wow. else because you already borrow money from him. And you need somebody else to help you to pay the rent. Yeah, yeah. He he ha he he has his own home. He I won't want him to live with me, no. <laughs> uh, no, 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 thanks. <laughs> I I'd rather to pay by myself and be free <laughs> with my kids. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I, I, I want you to I wanna do the same too. And then so okay. you see this right here. This, if you have ten thousand, is at least twelve thousand dollars. He should help you. Twelve thousand. I don't. I don't think he can help you with that much. But think, think about somebody else you can borrow money from. If he cannot help you that much, that can be from your from your boss or mm -hmm. from your company. They can advance you that money. I don't know if they can do that, but that's my yeah. suggestion. But if you want to check. Let's check on this. If your credit is higher, then you will see a lot of different. If your credit is, let's say, is a six hundred fifty to seven hundred. What is the best credit? Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Oh. Wow. You see, you pay much less. Oh, it's a lot less, yeah. yeah only seven, eighteen, so it's a lot of cheaper. A lot of cheaper. Oh yeah, hundreds of hundred fifty dollars something like that, cheaper. And I wanted to sh let you know that please pay off your credit card debt as soon as yeah. possible, so we can help you. Maybe you help you to jump to this range, maybe higher, and so you don't have to pay a lot of money and you'll be helping you a lot really a lot really a lot yeah i have a customer who paid seventeen hundred dollars of a space rent in only seventeen hundred dollars a pound seventeen uh, only for land only the yeah only for rent yes <clears throat> that's a lot of money plus why too much plus she about all she has a price for we can definitely negotiate to get the price lower yeah. but uh, if it's too low they're not accepting wow 17 is too much yeah. plus the mortgage i, I know 17 country 21 country a month month's rent monthly rent every month but they make more money yeah, it would be. They make more money. That is not too much for them. Yeah. Yeah, they make more money. So that's why. That's why. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, I I, I want you to feel good and uh, be able to buy the house so that you can move into with your family, with your two kids. They need a space. That's what I can tell. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. They're growing so fast, so they will. And you, one you the to, own space you need to ask yourself do you like this one with a 154 900 or do you like this one with a 219 900 you ask yourself yeah the big one the one has three bedroom right 219 219 has a three bedroom and two bath three nine and yeah the bigger one yeah they have more bedroom yeah much, much bigger size and uh for this one is two bedroom and two bath you can tell right here and it's mm -hmm. 960 square footage little smaller size but uh it's not saying this is bad because 980 is still very big size very big size no but the three bedroom would be better yeah yes yes i i say that's true uh, another thing I want to tell you is uh, when you buy the house, when you buy the mobile home, you need to buy the 
homeowner insurance. Oh, is, yeah, yeah. And also the apartment where I live required it, yeah. I paid a home insurance. Yeah, but then, no, that, that's the, you're buying the rent, renters insurance. Yeah. Oh, right? yeah, 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 yeah. I hear and that from my kids. You need to buy yeah. homeowner insurance. That's like a, yeah. close to $800, $900 a year. One year. Oh, yeah. So it's not okay. bad. It's not bad. Every year. Okay. Right. Yeah. And then we need to, non company will ask you for approval insurance you buy. Right, yeah. 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 So, Even uh, apartment rental, they are required to buy a rental insurance. Yes. We have to pay. Yes, yeah. that's true. That's true. Yeah. So, my no, message okay. to you is uh, get a price that's good, you think you can afford. And uh, the house is here, you know, you, don't, you can just buy and uh, move in and make sure everything is good. And then you have your own space, you know. And I understand you want the kids to have a, each room for each person. Mm -hmm. But uh, since they are still young, maybe they can, you know, I, I don't know. I don't just, mm -hmm. I suggest, but you, you, you do whatever you want. You do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. You take this tool, show it to your husband, your ex-husband to see which one he likes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll ask his opinion too. Yes, okay. Yeah, yeah we are friends. Uh, we talked, yeah. Yeah, he talked, yeah, just let him know about this, you know, because uh, this need a, it, even though it need a, he needed his opinion, but doesn't mean he helped you to make a decision. That's one thing I want to tell no, you. No, yeah, let's go to hear someone's opinion, right? Close to you, someone close to you. Yeah. yeah. It but doesn't, doesn't mean, yeah. He make a decision for you, okay? Because yeah. you still, because you are the one live here, not he doesn't live here. Yeah. So yeah, you right. still make a decision by yourself. Only. You only listen to what, you know, advice. You listen, you hear what he say, but you make your own decision. Because you are right. the one who's here. So you, also, if you want to see the house, let me know. We can arrange it for you to see the house also. Okay. They allow you to see the house. Okay. Only I will send you a message, okay? A message. Uh, yeah. Also the mask. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sure, definitely, yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm going out to do my grocery before I get a little late. <laughs> okay, okay, uh, okay, okay. Thank you very much for your Thank time. You so we'll much. keep in contact. We'll keep yes, in contact, I definitely. Will. Thanks. Thank you so much. Let me know, Thank okay? You. Yeah, I will. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye.